So one of the most important elements of an agile and innovative culture is that of curiosity. And one specific practice where work is defined in these sprints, short bursts, is to have a retrospective meeting at the end. And this can also apply to board of directors meetings. And so chairpersons looking to improve and make board meetings continually fresh and, and members engaged can also apply this exercise, where at the end of every meeting, we ask the three retrospective questions, which is number one, what did we do well in that last meeting that we should continue in the next meeting? The second one, what didn't go well? Let's stop doing that in the next meeting. And the third is, what have we learned that we can try something new for the next meeting? Where the principle is, we're always gonna make at least one tweak for the next meeting to keep it always alive and, and engaging. And when we did this, we uncovered some very interesting ideas, including, for example, um, having management prepare the key issues in a maximum of two pages to get board members very, very focused and come with a lot of points to contribute to discussions. Or the other point on suddenly discovering that we really needed to have and engage board members to be willing to speak out on topics where they may not be subject matter experts. Because traditionally we tend to only want to contribute on areas that we think we know best. But sometimes it's that external view where we ask questions as an outsider to a particular topic and that can add a lot of richness uh, to board discussions. So here's a way to implement curiosity through these retrospective questions and hopefully chairmen of uh, boards can infuse and keep board meetings uh, more interesting and engaging and the companies uh, being much more dynamic.